Do you want to get into the top 10% F2 times at all tracks on F1 22 like me? Sure you do, sim racing fans. Today we're looking at Monza and Suzuka. First up, Monza, where it's important to get turn one right. Forget it. When you do get turn one right, you don't want to be on the power too strong and too soon either. Also, watch out for slippery curves and runoff, like here at Parabolica. Or here, on the exit of Lesmo 2. And there's a helpful reminder at the second chicane to be careful on the throttle again. So, we did it. What a performance. Top 4%, less than a second from numero uno. Let's see how we did it. So, full speed, six gear, over the line. On the approach to turn one, we want to be looking out for the 100 meter board and braking there. Lightly lift off the brakes. Hug the curbs as closely as you can. On the power as soon as you're as straight or as brave as you dare. Round curve of Grande full speed. And we want to be looking out for the 100 meter board again for the second chicane. Down to second or third, whatever you're most comfortable with. Hug the curbs nice and tight. Full power out. Up to Lesmo 1 then. Slide dab of the brake. And then power in the mid corner to use the maximum runoff. Lesmo 2 again. Slide dab of brakes. Down one gear. And full power. Trying to maximise the runoff as much as possible as we go into the DRS zone once again. Under the bridge, full speed. We want to be looking out for the 100 meter board again for Ascari. Brakes down two gears to fourth. Take as much curb as you want. Then full power from the middle all the way out, using as much runoff as you can. Then it's full power again, all the way down to Parabolica. And this time you're going to drop from sixth at the 50 board down to fourth. And then once you mid corner, back on the power again, maximizing the width. Careful not to take too much of the green, which is really slippery. Full power to the line. And there you have it, a 1 minute 29.506. So then, time to go to Suzuka. Here at Spoon Curve, you'll see that catching too much curb on the inside will spin you out. And here at the exit of Degna 2, you can bottom out quite easily, but don't repeat it again like I did. And surely only an idiot would do it three times. Yep. Or you could just get Degna 1 wrong and bypass Degna 2 altogether. Here's the exit of the S's. Got a little out of shape. Run wide and spin. And basically a carbon copy again. So those are all the pain points, I think. But we managed it. We are top 9%. And we are not far at all. We are 1.2 seconds off the top 10 in 38th position of 471 players. So, time to do the lap. Full speed over the line here. DRS open. Now at the end of here, you want to just lift. Down two gears. To fourth and then power out. Coast round here. Down to third. And then just hug the curbs closely just brush them but don't get on them too much little left and then once you're comfortable you can apply the full power without running wide do so so as we run up to Degna 1 you want to go down one gear down another for the exit of Degna 2 don't get too much curb like I was doing earlier and spinning out and at the end of the curbing break for the hairpin down to second, you can get on the power quite early there without spinning and get yourself out and round towards Spoon at full speed. Once you arrive at Spoon, it's down to fifth. Take as much width as you can, down again to fourth and then on the power after you exit the curbing and take it nice and wide on the exit. Hook the inside line on the run to 130R, and you've got plenty of downforce, so 130R is going to be full commitment, flat out. There you go, and you're going to be looking out for the 100 meter board right there to get it slowed down for the chicane. Into second gear, apply the power, careful it wants to get away from you, and then that's it, and I'm hugging the line 
There we go. We go across for a 1 minute 40.614, which got us in the 10%. So perfect, as the game awkwardly freeze frames at the end of the lap, there's just time for me to say, I hope that helped you out and you'll be joining me for getting into the top 10% of two more tracks next time. Take care.